I think Ireland has to get something straight with the rest of the world, or maybe just Hollywood. You see, we don't all sound like leprechauns on acid. Thank you, Tom Cruise, Jared Butler, and Jesus have mercy on her soul, Julia Roberts. <laughs> There's actually a big difference if you're either from the north, south, east or west of Ireland. Let's break it down and set this record straight. Are you listening Roberts? Dublin is the capital, and the accent here was heavily influenced by the British occupation of Ireland for more than 800 years. What's odd is that for such a relatively small city, we have two very distinct accents, generally assigned to north and south side. On the north side, you'll hear people talking like this. Here the D replaces TH, so you get a lot of this, that, these and those. And if there's a T at the end of a word, bleed and forget it. Venture south and they'll speak absolutely like this. The South Dublin resident is all about the O's and O's. Elongate those vowels like, yeah, yeah, like totally the opposite of the narrow sounds of the North Sider. Moving into the south we come to the People's Republic of Cork boy. For some weird reason everyone here speaks a few octaves higher than the rest of the country boy. It's a little bit forlorn and a little bit melodic and every now and again boy is thrown in for the crack. Fair play to you boy. Now move down a bit and you're into West Cork where it all gets a bit thicker and a bit faster sure. Then there's Kerry and that is probably the jewel in the Irish accent crown. Not sure even Irish people understand this, unless they're from the kingdom itself. Sure it's fast and it's furious, SH features even when it's not there, you know like. Sure doesn't it sound better for it like, you know. Limerick is more nasal and sharper on the ear so you can tell you've left the kingdom far behind. You might get called a goal if you're acting the maggot or if you're langers. Now we're going way up north. I tell you it's very different, especially in Belfast. Sure, the Scottish plantation of Ulster was so successful that it changed the way they speak forever. Now is pronounced now. I means yes and a wee cracker is a beautiful girl so it is. So this is how we sound, do you know what I mean bud? And it's a totes generalisation like. But sure it is what it is boy. And it's only a broad guide from an Irish gal like. But sure, we're only having the crack. <laughs>